Hi, Ed A. Kirst here, and we're going to look today at Email Miner. This is a software I offer that allows you to grab email addresses and social media profiles of keyword-based leads. Let's take a look at the software once you've downloaded it and logged in. Let's close these out. I was doing a thing for website design. We'll close these out and we'll start fresh. You see you can do all of these at once. Um, I'm going to show you how to do them individually, and then if you want to get run a longer run, you can do that. Um, I've got 56 people in my last list I had started, so you can always clear your list. Hit that and then confirm within three seconds, and it'll clear the list. You have to confirm that and hit it twice. That's a safety feature so you don't accidentally uh, lose the list you have. Um, let's go ahead and just do website design, right? And where do we want to find these people? All right, why don't we look for people... Who who are doing website design and have Facebook pages. And let's look for people with Gmail addresses. Uh, let's just do those first. Okay, now you can do more than one and just let it run, but uh, you're probably better segregating your lists like this. And then just hit start mining emails. What it'll do is it's going to go <clears throat> and look for the, the site that you have, the web address, email address ending, and your keyword. And it'll scan down there and it'll grab it out of the listing. And it'll tell you how many it got from that page. Uh, we have nine, it says over there. So we got nine of them on that first page. And now it's doing the next page. Nine emails found. We're up to 18. And it won't always get nine. It might get six or seven or, you know, it, but however many it gets, it gets. And we'll, we'll run a couple more of these and then I'll show you what the the data looks like and how it exports. See, there were only seven on that particular page. Let's do one more page and then we'll stop just for purposes of this example. And see how fast it grabs these? You could do this manually, but you would spend hours and hours and hours just grabbing a few of them. All right, so once you've got what you need, you can click the icon there again and you can hit stop mining emails. All right. And uh, we have 34, so let's just download the list. It'll automatically download to wherever your computer sends downloaded files. And let's just take a look at what we've got, okay? So what we have here is the keyword, the email address. You notice we asked for Gmail. So look at these. These are, these are legitimate emails. Uh, are they still active? Who knows? These people may not be, you know, it's possible they've ranked and then they're out of the business. Uh, but most of these look like, you know, emails that people use. Once in a while, you might find a an info ad or something that might not be good. I would run these through Unbounce uh, or some type of web, you know, email list cleaner before you load them up to your email. But you get your keyword, your email, the name of the page that the information came from and the URL of that page. So you could even go out to their websites if you're going to do some, some more personalized communications. You could go to their website and, and take a look at them and get some info. If you're just going to load this stuff up into your email, your cold email program or software, whatever you use to send it, uh, you'll know the keyword you have and you'll know, you know, basically where you got them from. So that's email miner. That's how it works. It's a fantastic extension and uh, check it out. Give us a go and let me know if you need anything or you have any uh, questions or need help with anything. And we look forward to you getting lots and lots of leads and getting extra business from having the contact info to reach out to them. Take care.